Have you ever found yourself caught in the whirlwind of worry about what others might think about you? This seemingly innocent concern can often morph into a debilitating addiction, an addiction seeking the approval of others. Consider the story of Emily. Emily, a talented artist, always dreamt of showcasing her unique style of art to the world. Yet, she found herself constantly altering her style to fit the mold of what she believed others would approve of. She traded her originality for the fleeting satisfaction of approval. What Emily didn't realize was that in this pursuit of approval she was losing her own identity, her own voice. Then there's the case of Mark. Mark was a brilliant entrepreneur with a flair for innovative ideas. Yet he was so preoccupied with how his peers perceived him that he began to second-guess his every move. He was so afraid of disapproval that he compromised his unique business ideas to fit into what he thought was the right path. In his quest for approval, Mark stifled his own creativity and ingenuity. These are not isolated incidents. Many find themselves trapped in this vicious cycle of approval addiction. The constant need for validation from others, the fear of disapproval, can lead to a miserable existence. It can lead to a life walked on eggshells, a life devoid of authenticity. The true cost of approval addiction is the loss of oneself. The fear of disapproval can be so overpowering that it overshadows one's true desires and aspirations. And in this process, self-approval, the most crucial form of validation, often goes missing. How then can one overcome this detrimental addiction? The answer lies in understanding that the only approval that truly matters is self-approval. It's about recognizing that your worth is not determined by what others think of you, but by what you think of yourself. Start by acknowledging your unique qualities and achievements. Give yourself the credit you deserve. Do not let others dictate your worth. It's about learning to trust your instincts and decisions. It's about realizing that it's okay to make mistakes. It's okay to be imperfect. After all, it is our imperfections that make us human. Cultivate a strong sense of self-esteem. Believe in your abilities and potential. Remember the only person you need to please is yourself. It's about finding happiness within, not in the approval of others. The journey to overcoming approval addiction may not be easy. It requires courage, determination, and most importantly, self-love. But remember, at the end of this journey lies the freedom to be your authentic self. The freedom to live your life on your terms. In conclusion, approval addiction can lead to a life devoid of authenticity and self-fulfillment. The key to overcoming this is to focus on self-approval, to believe in your worth and potential. It's about learning to trust your instincts, embracing your imperfections and finding happiness within. Remember the only approval that truly matters is self-approval. The only person you need to please is yourself. So the next time you find yourself worrying about what others might think about you, remember Emily and Mark. Remember the cost of approval addiction. And remember the only approval that truly matters is self-approval. It's your life.